Temperatures have been hovering near that 60 degree mark all day today. Some spots broke 60 degrees. Most of the valley stayed in the upper 50s. Right now it's 58 in Lancaster. The same in Harrisburg. A little cooler right now for you folks in Lebanon where you're sitting at 56 degrees. You can see the clouds are socked in right now over Lebanon City. And you got some light rain falling near the airport right now. 56 with the dew point holding at 56. It's that light breeze out of the east or northeast that's helping keep the clouds around. And they're going to be sticking around through the evening hours. So your News 8 Storm Team forecast cloudy and damp with that patchy on and off drizzle or rain. There may be a few breaks in the clouds in our eastern county. So if you're watching us in Lebanon County, eastern Lancaster County, northern Dauphin County, you may see some breaks after sunset through the night tonight. Look for mostly cloudy skies. The patchy drizzle will continue. There also may be some patchy fog. Lows tonight will be near the 50 degree mark. And then as we head through tomorrow, it's going to be a near repeat of today. Temperatures will remain cool thanks to the clouds and there will be some patchy showers and temperatures will be just a touch warmer. Look for highs to be in the low to mid 60s. Football Friday continues tomorrow. I think the games across the Susquehanna Valley will be able to play, but the ground or the turf will be wet. Temperatures at Hanover taking on Littlestown will be in the upper 50s. Right now on Super Doppler 8, you can see most of the area is dry, but patchy drizzle and some light showers continue to fall, especially right along the Susquehanna River near Peckway up towards Cresswell at this hour. Be on the lookout in Millersville. You could see some light rain or at least the rain picking up in intensity within the next half hour. So much of the Commonwealth is covered with clouds. You can see how skies are clear up towards Boston. That's because that's where we find the ridge of high pressure that's steering that cool marine air over the valley. We have a weak disturbance sitting off to our south that's helping generate these passing showers. That will start to move offshore. As we head through tomorrow, it's going to be a re repeat of today. Look for temperatures to remain near average or just below average with highs in the lower 60s. We'll start to see the clouds break as we head into Saturday afternoon. So I think we've got the clouds out there for the Millersville Parade. May see a few isolated showers, but with the breaks in the clouds as we head into Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, and with the winds changing direction, temperatures will be back up above average and they're going to continue to climb. So 60s tomorrow, 70s for Saturday, 80s for Sunday. Some spots will be near record highs on Sunday afternoon. Another cold front will move on through as we head through Sunday night into Monday. That will push temperatures back to near seasonal averages in the 60s where they should be for mid-October. And now with the check on the roads this evening, here's Jack Rappel in the news.